today's episode, we remember transnational freedom fighter Sardar Senji Ravaji Rana, who died on the 25th of May 1957. S.R. Rana was the founding member of the Paris Indian Society and the vice president of the Indian Home Rule Society. Rana was born on 10th of April 1870 in Katiawar, Gujarat. A classmate of Mahatma Gandhi, during high school, Rana studied in Ferguson College, Pune, where he came in contact with Lokmanya Tilak and Surendranath Banerjee. He got inspired to join the freedom movement as he volunteered at the Indian National Congress Conference in Pune in 1895. In London, while pursuing law, he came in contact with Shyamji Krishnavarma and Bhika Ji Kama. He was instrumental in the establishment of India House in London. In 1899, Rana left for Paris and came to associate with Indian nationalist politicians, including Lala Lajpat Rai, who is known to have visited Paris and stayed with Rana. In 1905, Rana became one of the founding members of the Indian Home Rule Society. Together with Munchir Shah Barjorji Godrej and Bhika Ji Kama, he founded the Paris Indian Society that same year as an extension of the Indian Home Rule Society on the European continent. Rana announced three scholarships for Indian students, each worth 2,000 rupees, in memory of Maharana Pratap, Chhatrapati Shivaji and Akbar in the December 1905 issue of the Indian sociologist. Rana helped the Indian independence movement in several ways. Madan Lal Dhingra had used his pistol to assassinate Curzon Bailey in 1909. He also helped Vinayak Damodar Savarkar to publish his banned book, The Indian War of Independence. He had also helped Savarkar in his Mahsai asylum case in the permanent court of arbitration, The Hague, in 1910. Lala Lajpat Rai had written Unhappy India during his stay in his house for five years. He had helped Senapati Bapat to travel to study making of bombs in Moscow. He had helped Subhash Chandra Bose to address the audience on German radio. He had also helped in the establishment of Banaras Hindu University. Rana developed close links with the French and Russian socialist movements and along with Bika Jikama attended the Second Socialist Congress at Stuttgart on 18th of August 1907 where the flag of Indian independence was presented by Kama. Rana was a regular contributor to Bande Mataram published by Kama from Paris and the Talwar published from Berlin which were then smuggled into India. Due to his nationalist activities, Rana was expelled by the French government to Martinique in 1911. The activities of the Paris Indian Society were also curtailed under pressure from the French Surete and finally suspended in 1914. Rana underwent a lot of personal losses in his life as his son and wife died. Thereafter, he abstained from public life and returned to India after independence in 1948. S.R. Rana died on the 25th of May 1957 in Veraval, Gujarat. He was awarded the Chevalier by the French government in 1951. We also remember Manipuri freedom fighter Kajao alias Ukramba, a resident of Kangamong, Manipur on 24th of March 1891. When British troops launched an attack on the Manipuri fort, Kajau killed the British political agent Grimwood. He was sentenced to death on the 19th of May 1891. Following his capture, Kajau was hanged on the 25th of May 1891 at the west gate of the fort. Kajau is remembered for sacrificing his life for the independent kingdom of Manipur. We salute the great martyr. We also remember Manipuri freedom fighter Hirang Khogja, who fought against the British in Anglo-Manipur War in 1891. Khogja hailed from the village Hirang in Manipur. He died at the Kongjom battlefield on the 25th of May 1891 during the Anglo-Manipur War.